Hello, welcome to this video. In this video, I am going to show you how you can install them. Hello, or how you can record your League of Legends games without losing any frame rate while playing. So, there's this program called LOL Replay or League of Legends Recorder, LOL Recorder. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna download it. So, go to int Interweb Browser, go to Google. Now you search for LOL Replay. We will get to this website, League Replays. Just click it. And, uh, and here you can press, press download. And you guys know how to install. You know how the install works. So this is how the I can show you. This is how the program looks like. It's very simple. Here you have my replace, which is your replace. It that automatically records all your videos or all your, all your games, so to say. You can browse other people's replays as well. You can see here we have some random people's replays. It's good for them. Oh well. And here they have their like patch log. <coughs> Not need to go deeper there though. So if you download the program, just install it. Everybody knows how to install a program. And you need to keep this running when you're playing League of Legends and it will automatically record for you. And you will get an all or F file which you can't upload to YouTube. So what you're gonna do is when you recorded a game with LOL recorder and you can't upload that to YouTube or anything. So what you're gonna do is you wanna start the replay here let's say we we'll start the replay let's not do it now but then you record you have to record with another program now this is just because as I just mentioned you can't upload all RF files to YouTube but you use the use of this program is because <coughs> You earn so much frame rating. It's, I mean, like, it's not comparable. You don't lose any frame rate at all while playing, so you can like record all the games. But the downside is that you can't upload it. So to upload, it, you need to start, for example, perhaps or everything else that will record for you. So yeah, I have perhaps. Pops up today. Uh, <coughs> yeah. So now let's start a replay. Hmm. Which one looks like the best? Hmm. Let's just go with. This game looks like a real good game. I'm playing an Ecton. That game is probably lost. This is a good game. So, oh, I didn't see it here. I will start. Mm. And <coughs> they. This is a pop up day. They noticed I'm running fraps. Let's just read it. We noticed you're running fraps. Speed adjustment in the LOL replay causes. Problems when attempting to record with fraps. Would you like to disable cooldown timers thinking to fix this issue? Note that this will cause cooldown timers to desync when using fast forward or slow motion. Just click yeah. This doesn't really mean anything. It's just it's the only thing is that the cooldowns will be out synced on your champion, but that's not of importance. 
So as you can see in my left corner here, down here I have fraps running. And uh, this is taking a really long time. Let's just hope they didn't have any wooden calculators. Oh well, you get my point. Then you press it's F9 fraps. Now it records. Now I'll get them fraps file, which is like huge. But the reason for using the lottery player is because you save so many FPS for playing, and then <coughs> when you're going to record the game afterwards, if you got a really good score or something, then you can just start game, or start a replayer, and Equip with fraps, you will lose frame rate, but since you're not playing, you don't need to react to things, so we can just like AFK and record it. So that's really good. And I'm pretty sure it's everything, so yeah. I'll see you around, bitches.